I got that. <laughs> We're gonna do something a little bit different. No, I don't like it. Okay, Saturday before Easter. Uh, sorry if I keep you waiting a little bit, uh, but I was trying to, to find a solution to the audio. In the end, I didn't find it, so I'm still recording on my phone. Good. Uh, I made a few days ago a tomato sauce base, uh, which usually goes for uh, a dish, which is a winter dish. Uh, and uh, it's a sauce um, used as a condiment for polenta. For those of you who don't know what polenta is, it's basically corn flour and um, you just need to put it in the water and uh, on the fire. Pa -pa 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 -pa. Done. Okay, what I'm gonna do with the sauce is to make aubergine parmigiana, melanzane parmigiana, eggplant parmigiana. It depends where you're from. Very easy. I've got this uh, tomato sauce with uh, pork ribs, I'm gonna leave you the, the recipe in the description below. Uh, I've got aubergines, usually in the original recipe um, this should be deep fried, but from the time that the sauce is quite rich, uh, I just grilled them and marinated them with a little bit of olive oil, basil and salt. Mozzarella parmesan. Okay, very very easy. You take a little bit of your sauce, you put it in here, we like to do something a bit more stylish. Maybe like this is better. Then take your aubergines. You want to create a kind of uh, layers like you would do when you make uh, lasagna. This is actually a vegetarian kind of lasagna without pasta. Then put a little bit of your mozzarella, a little bit more sauce. At this point I like to grate some parmesan. Let's see if I can do another layer. Yes, I can. This looks already insane. Once you finish them, this is how they look like. Of course, when I'm gonna cook them, I think they gonna disrupt a little bit. It's all right, it's fine. Oven hot, 180 degrees. We wanna put them in the oven for eight, 10 minutes. After six minutes, this is how they look like. We're gonna take one.
And this is the final result. How does it look like? Would you enjoy it? If you missed last video on how to make the real carbonara, you can find it on top here on the left. Uh, please leave me some comments below so um, I can make something else for you. Just uh, give me suggestions. Let me know if there's something in particular that you want to know how to make and I will do it. Uh, probably I will do cacio e pepe pasta. That's very good. Um, what else? I'll see you next time. Ciao!